Hey you guys, welcome back to a brand new day of English class. And so today, do you guys notice where the teacher is? Can you guys see that behind me, you guys? There is a closet. Say with me, closet. But what is that teacher? You guys, that's where we put our clothing away, okay? We put our clothes, our hats, our shirts, our pants. But why are we here, teacher? Because guess what? Today we're going to finish talking about the weather. But it's important, you guys, that we know what do we wear for the different weathers, okay? Because you guys, we can wear a bathing suit outside when it's raining, right? Nope. So we have to be ready to dress up for every weather and that's what we're going to see in today's class. Are you guys ready? All right, so let's go. All right, so if you guys look and see, we see our beautiful calendar. Do you guys see our calendar? Yep. And so we remember that the month is July and so today is Thursday, say with me, Thursday, July 23rd. And the year is 2020. So let's continue to today's class. All right, you guys, so it's super important that what? That we dress up for the weather because if we're not wearing the right clothing, you guys, we can be too hot or we can be too cold or you guys, guess what? If it's raining, we can get wet ah, yeah, yeah. and then we come home and we're wet and then we can get sick and we have a fever and we have a cough <coughs> no we don't want that right so we have to what we have to make sure that we're wearing the correct clothing for what for every day aha uh -huh. but you guys for each weather you guys did such an amazing job i have to say with your weather reports you guys were super cute and you guys were saying my name is, this is the weather. You guys, great job. Everybody, round of applause. Great job, all right. But let's continue. So, you guys are gonna say, but teacher, if we have to change the clothes, what do we wear? So, what do we wear? Well, let's go over a few clothing, you guys. We're gonna say the name. You guys are gonna see the picture. We're gonna practice the name, and then we're gonna do something super fun because a teacher is gonna dress up for each weather. Are you guys ready for that? Yeah? Because you guys are gonna help tell me what? Teacher's wearing a shirt or a hat or a raincoat. But before we get there, let's review the vocabulary words. All right, you guys. So now we're gonna go over the vocabulary for the different clothing. But I want you to pay close attention with your eyes, with your ears, so that we can listen to see what is the clothing for. Are you ready? So the teacher is going to tell you the name and I'm going to include when can we wear it. Are you guys ready? Yes? So let's begin with the first picture. So here you guys we see the rain coat. One more time, rain coat. And the rain coat we can wear during rainy weather. Awesome job. Next, we see the picture of the boots. So we put the boots on our feet for the rainy weather or the cold weather. One more time, boots. The next vocabulary word, you guys, is pants. One more time, pants. And the pants we wear when it's windy, when it's cold, when it's raining, right? And if we don't want to be cold, we have to make sure that our pants are long. What do they have to be? Long. So one more time, pants. The next picture, you guys, is of a t-shirt. So the t-shirt we can wear when it's sunny outside. We can wear it any weather, okay? If it gets cold, all we have to do is put a jacket over it. So this word is t-shirt. One more time, t-shirt. The next picture, you guys, is of sandals. And so the sandals we can wear on a nice sunny day, very good, but we wanna make sure not to wear it when it's rainy because our feet can get wet, okay? So these are sandals and we can wear it for a sunny day. This next picture is of shorts. 
Say with me, shorts. And these, you guys, are short pants, right? So we can wear these on a sunny day or on a windy day if you're not too cold, okay? But if it's raining, you guys, what? We want to make sure that we're wearing long pants, okay? So this is a picture of shorts. The next picture, you guys, is of a scarf. Everybody say with me, scarf. Very good. And the scarf, you guys, we can wear when it's windy outside or cold and it protects our neck, okay? So we put the scarf around our, what? Neck, so that it protects us from the wind and the cold. So one more time, the word is scarf. Awesome job, you guys. And the last one is a coat. Everybody say with me, coat. Very good. And the coat we put on you guys when it's cold outside or windy, because guess what? We wanna protect our bodies from the cold. Because what did the teacher say? We don't wanna get sick, right? Mm -mm. We don't want a fever or a cough. <coughs> no, right? So we wear the coat when it's cold awesome job so this is a picture of a coat the teacher is gonna play dress up are you guys ready oh. hey you guys so i just woke up and i'm wearing my my pajamas right but you guys i have to get ready for a sunny day so let me go change really quick and i'll be right back oh i'm ready for the sunny day you guys here I have my t-shirt, I'm wearing my shorts, I have my sandals on, and you guys, I couldn't forget my sunglasses. Ah, well, you guys, now it's a windy day, so I have to go change. I'll be right back. All right, you guys, I think I'm ready for the windy day. I have my sweater on, I have my long pants on, and some shoes, but just in case you guys I get a little cold, I can always grab my, here it goes, I can always grab my jacket. Oh, and my outfit is complete. We did, what, sunny weather, uh-huh. We did windy weather, but you guys, what, you guys, you know me. I have to get ready, you guys, for what? For a rainy day, so I'll be right back. Here I am, you guys. I'm ready for the rainy weather. I'm wearing my raincoat. I have my rain boots on. Oh, they're so nice and red, right? And guess what else, you guys? I'm not gonna forget my umbrella, right? Because if it's raining really hard, I have to go open my umbrella and put it, let's see. Let's try it out. Are you guys ready? So here, open the umbrella, put it over my head, and walk in the rain. All right, you guys, but we have one more weather, we have cold weather. So, are you guys ready for my outfit? Yeah, so let me go change. Ta -da! You guys, I'm ready for the cold weather. So you guys see what? I'm wearing my hat, I have my scarf on, I have my coat, right? And I zip it up, it's close. I'm wearing some boots for the cold, and I'm wearing long what? Long pants. And what do I have on my hands? I'm wearing gloves. So this is for cold weather. But you guys, since we have to go back to class, I have to go put on my uniform, so I'll be right with you. All right, you guys, so I'm back in my uniform and that means that I'm ready to go back to today's class. So let's go. All right, you guys, so now that we're finished with today's class, we have a few special friends that want to say goodbye. Do you guys know who they are? Well, there are letters, you guys. You remember that we were practicing the letters S, the letter A, the letter T, the letter I, the letter P, and the letter N. And guess what, you guys? They want to say goodbye. So let's go with them really quick so that they can say goodbye. Are you guys ready? So let's see our letters. All right, you guys, here are our letter friends, and guess what? They have a goodbye message for you guys, and they want to teach you how to say something super cool. So let's meet our friends. 
Here we have Sammy S. Here's Anthony A, Tony T, Ian I, Peter P, and Nathan N. And guess what? They wanted to say goodbye class. They wanted to teach you guys something super cool. Are you ready? All right, you guys, here's what they're gonna say. They're going to tell you guys, See you later, alligator. <gasps> One more time. See you later, alligator. But letters, how are they supposed to respond? <gasps> well, class, you guys have to say, After a while, crocodile. One more time. After a while, crocodile. So let's try that together. See you later, alligator. After a while, crocodile. Awesome job, you guys. So, letters, say bye to the kids. And kids, say bye, letters. All right, you guys, so what did we learn from them? They taught us how to say what? <gasps> See you later, alligator. And you guys have to say, after a while, crocodile. So, one more time, the teacher's gonna say, See you later, alligator. And you guys have to say, after a while, crocodile. Are you guys ready? One more time, one more time. Okay, so the teacher says, See you later, alligator. And you guys say, after a while, crocodile. All right, you guys, so awesome job today. I hope you guys learned a bunch. A bunch, teacher? Uh-huh, that means a lot. So I hope you guys learned a lot in today's class. And for your activity, guess what? You guys have to dress up for the four weathers, okay? And you're gonna make a super cool collage with your different outfits, okay? And remember, keep practicing. You guys are gonna say, mom, dad, what's today's weather, right? And you guys get to answer, and what else? You guys can say, it's a windy day, I have to put on my, or it's a sunny day, I have to put on my, all right, so, Awesome job, let's finish with a quick prayer and say thank you God for one more day. Thank you for your love for me, your love for the world. Help me to love like you. In your name we pray, amen. All right, you guys, this teacher loves you how much? So, so much. And I'll see you guys again next week. Bye-bye.